right, well, we are about to begin a journey building this Lego Ideas number 46, the A-frame cabin. I'll give you a closer look at it and uh, see what you all think about this cabin uh, Lego set. Looks pretty awesome. Uh, 2,082 pieces uh, building set. And uh, we've got a couple of campers here, and we're going to see about putting this thing together. What do you think, Jack? It's uh, cool. It is cool. There is a guy who I think looks like me. We'll point it out on here, and then we'll point it up to them. All right, so, so Jack thinks that this character looks like him right there. Uh, let's see if we'll get some focus. i got to hide the eyes, I guess. There we go. One piece. On his den, it's going to be like almost three pieces, basically. We got bag number 12, number 15. This looks super cool, guys. There's a phase one and a phase two. Looks like there's like a nighttime version and a daytime version. I'm not really sure what the difference is in all of that. So we're gonna stop the video here and we're gonna switch over to a time lapse uh, to begin our build. And then if something interesting comes along in our build, we'll stop, we'll switch back to video and show you what that looks like. Let's go. We've been working on this for several hours now. Um, the boys have been doing some of the, the bags by themselves. I've just been kind of overseeing a little bit. Uh, but they've been doing a great job. There's tons of detail in here. And we'll get some video footage to show you all the little uh, parts and pieces. What was what has been one of your favorite things to build inside the cabin? Um, to build? I'm not totally sure. Or maybe what's just your favorite piece inside there? I think I like the rocks. They're pretty cool. Yeah, so there's some like some little geodes and uh, that kind of thing that are inside, and that's pretty cool. Jack, what about you? Probably my favorite inside thing is probably uh, the rug, the door, and the windows. Mm, yeah, and there's a little rug inside that says Lego on it. Yeah, and the windows and are really cool. And I also kind of like the record player. Yeah, but there's outside. a record player. So we'll, we'll get some other footage just so you can see all the inside pieces uh, when it's all done. And you can see all the inside parts. But it's very, very detailed. So it's not like it's just the shell of something, but there's lots and lots of little pieces inside um, and little uh, miniature builds within the build uh, that makes it really cool. We've got this really intricate tree as well. Um, they yeah, both did a really good job on that. So that was all part of um, book number one. And let's see if I can hold that up there for you. Book number one. Yeah. And uh, so, what's in here? Oh, a little piece left over. Oh. 
And so now, um, book number one, that took us through how many bags? Nine bags? Uh, eight. Actually, eight. no, seven. Only seven. Yeah. And then book two takes you through eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15. Okay, so quite a bit. So, so that was number one. So now we're gonna move on to book number two. Uh, book number two. And uh, get building on that. So we're gonna jump back to the time lapse and try to give you some other angles so you can see uh, the whole construction happening. Yeah. I just wanted to say probably my uh, favorite outside part is probably the shower. The shower? I yeah, they really like this outdoor shower. And again, we'll get you a, a closer up look on that. Um, I also like the lamp. Yeah, so yeah, you got this like outdoor shower with a towel holder, a um, little bar of soap there, and that kind of thing. So it's really, really, really fun. So, all right, you boys ready to continue to build? Yeah! All right, let's do it. So here we are, we have finally completed the A-Frame Cabin Lego set. What do you guys think? Yes! yes it it's very cool, very cool Lego set indeed. So we've got the multicolored trees here, it's kind of like changing of season. There's so many intricate details, so many really uh, small things, like um, even the bed inside. Uh, it's not just like a bed piece, like you stick in the whole bed, it's like you build the whole frame and like you put the sheets on the bed and then the cover on the bed. Most of that you don't even see, but because we built it, we know that it's there. And that's pretty much all of these parts and pieces is you see all of the layers when you're building it to get to this uh, final product. So there's lots in, uh, of little, little details everywhere. And I think each of us kind of have our favorite. So Jack, why don't we start with you? What's your favorite little detail part of this? It's hard because I kind of like all of it. You do? Yeah, that's it is kind of cool. Henry, do you have any favorite part? Mm, probably outside. I like that secret block. Place. Oh yeah, that that was gonna be my favorite. Okay, so you I have like on these favorite. sides here these little tree things, and um, they easily detach, and so you can have them away from the cabin itself, so the cabin can you know be free from it. Um, but what you can also do is you can take these two pieces and uh, they can slide and interlock and then you kind of have this whole like tree there's a little um, there's like a little otter with a little like waterfall thing down there a little frog and the canoe is over there it has just these like little canoe rest area came with a couple of life jackets and that crate uh, a couple of oars back here a little lantern hanging off the tree and of course you got this like wood uh, wood box for the fireplace that's inside the house uh, birds up on the trees so really really cool I think this is probably my favorite part is I just I've never seen a tree like this uh, with Lego and um, it was a lot of fun to put together and I think it looks awesome it's really bright and vibrant so we'll set that aside so we can talk um, a little bit more about the cabin the main piece of this magnificent art right <laughs> So um, we got the front porch, of course, and you can spin around the back. You can get a good look at the uh, the chimney uh, that's coming out of the stove from the inside. And don't forget the shower, the outdoor shower. The outdoor shower with the towel that's hanging there. That's pretty fun, huh? Yeah. The towel is a door. Yeah, it's like First, a Lego door yeah. from early uh, Lego cars, but you can give it a different use. In this case, it is like a towel. All right, can you, you gentlemen show us like, how do you then interact with the stuff that's on the inside? So basically. Yeah, go ahead, Jack. You take off the roof. Yep, and it just rests on there. 
So it looks nice and finished when it's on, but it's very easy to take off and put back on. And you can also, I mean, I'm not gonna take it off now, but you can also take off the other level. The second story? Yeah. Yeah, it's not too hard to put on and off if you really want to. We don't really the want chimney to. separates right there too. Yeah. yeah, so then you have access to the inside. So you can see the different levels, the stairs. There's like some custom furniture in there. What else is in there, guys? Um, there's a little trophy upstairs. There's a and a camera. But it's on the other side. Yeah, so we can switch over as you can see. So there's like a camera right there. Some guitar, there's yeah, the trophy guitar. was on the side that you were just looking at. Books, it's a lot. Yeah, so there's many little, little parts and pieces. The record shot. player, um, so we'll give you some other close up videos of that um, and the mat there, too. But I think, all in all, we might have been in five or six hours or so, uh, maybe a little bit longer than that. Over uh, a course of days, yeah, over a weekend, yeah, over, over several days. We just worked on it when we could. And uh, I'll have to maybe check the time lapse for sure about how long it took. But, but yeah, I just appreciate all the, the tiny little details and that it had you build a lot of stuff rather than just have a lot of pre-made uh, parts and pieces. Um, how did you do this? It, yeah, it's not on the back. You can only pull it from the front. So in the two ends that come out, there's this like waterfall otter land. But then you can slide this rock formation out and it's like a little otter home. And they can fit right inside there. Maybe they can lay down for their rest, or that's where they hide out. And it slides and locks right back in. So it's just kind of a little hidey place. Yeah, I can there's, a, there's a lot of hiding things. Like, for some reasons, they put a nut under the entire house, and we're still not sure why, but they just didn't. Probably for fun. Yeah, there's little the little nuts for the squirrels, little acorns, um, kind of hidden throughout the house. There's one underneath the bed and Look. one underneath the house. Yeah, and then there's also he's sitting just. So there you have it. This is the A-frame cabin. Uh, like I said, I think it's just over 2,000 pieces. Uh, it took us several hours, but it is a lot of fun. So we'll add it to our national park themed uh, room down here. And I think it'll be a great addition to our decoration. What do you got, Jack? You want to show something close? Uh, this is just the little otter that came with it. Right, they saw it now. So, uh, yeah, that's the uh, little otter. It's Lego, too. It's also Lego. So there you have it. Hope you enjoyed our journey with building this Lego set. And if it's been a while since you've built a Lego set, it's time to get out and build because it's still a lot of fun. Yeah, even for, even for adults.